Hello folks, welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. And on the last episode, I went out and explored a bunch more of the city, did a bunch of side stuff, had a bit of a sad ending here on one of the side missions here at the apartment. And, uh, yeah, I want to continue checking out some side stuff this time. Seeing more of the city and all that good stuff. Yeah, we had this shooting range, uh, mission that popped up last time. Since we're right here, why don't we go ahead and see what that's all about. Hey V, about to start. You uh, got to take a piss or something? Uh, now's the time. Thanks for your concern. Let's start this rodeo. <laughs> Can't just yet. Not till you get in the range. Go on, set up, chop chop. All right. Oh, got notes. Ammo? I need that. I don't have much ammo. I'm sure, I'll just loot everything. Nice glasses. Alrighty, how many we got? Just six? God damn. Well, no point crying about it. <clears throat> Rules are simple, right? There's the target, shoot it. Don't matter which one, go on and shoot your neighbors. Most hits win. Uh, meaning hits on the target, not your neighbor. Oh, right, uh, small caliber iron only. Don't go showing off with your fucking assault bangers or no rocket pukers, got me? First prize is a pistol, but uh, a, a real nice one. It's fucking nice, I'm telling you. Anyway, uh, enough words. Worked up. Ready? All right. No, not that one. Not that one either. My pink scope. All right. Three. Two. Should have used a different hey, pistol. Hey, the hell is that? The hell are you doing with that double barrel? Said small caliber only. Uh, forgot my iron. Must be in my other jacket. I told you in the holster. A holster! Get the fuck out of my sight now! <laughs> fuck, June. Chill. I'm going. I'm going. Pearls before swine, for fuck's sake. All right. Three. Two, one. All right. Target. Hit the target, not the wall. What do you think I'm doing? I can't help that this thing is burst fire. Looking good, Rudy. Go, go, go. Halfway there, Pete. Get a grip for fuck's sake. What are you talking about? What the hell was that, Lisa? Forget your glasses? I'm hitting stuff just fine, aren't I? I should have used like a semi auto pistol instead of a burst fire. Last chance, Pete! What? 47 out of 100? How did I do that badly? Hold on, maybe I can do this again. I need a different pistol. Luckily I have different pistols. What the hell is that? That one has high DPS. First place, V! Oh. Second, Rudy! Rest of you bush league punks, learn to shoot! Out of my sight, now! Cool. Oh, thanks, Wilson. That sure is pretty. Uh huh. Yeah. Hey, you okay? Something wrong? <sighs> Ain't a damn thing that's right. Contest didn't do shit. Didn't sell a goddamn thing. Nothing. Should try not call the potential buyers bush league. Good something you gotta respect. If you don't know how to shoot, don't do it! Ugh. Take care of me. I'll see you around. Uh huh. Okay, well, I got a cool pistol, I think. Let's have a look at it. Doesn't actually have very good DPS. It's an epic pistol. Has a mod. Um. 
This thing is way higher DPS. Is there like something I can do with it? Put a suppressor on it. Don't want to scope. Hmm. Is it uh crafting? Can I do anything with this? No. Oh, I need rare and epic stuff. Oh, that's the wrong pistol. Um Oh, I can craft a pistol? What the hell is this? A tech sniper rifle? That looks pretty awesome. I know I'm in crafting here. Um perks required. I still don't quite get this. Yeah, this one is the one I got before. Oh, it's something I can craft. Hmm. Let's see what this does. All right. I don't quite get this pistol. Why I just got it. Why it's epic. Huh. Well, I need to sell some stuff. Um, I am curious what the hell this is. It's actually better than what I have equipped. What a surprise. All right. Let me have a look at it. That is so... Whoa. This thing is cool looking. Except for you can do a charge shot with it too. Interesting. Then I have the tech shock unequipped and that. This thing is cool, but uh, so is this. I need ammo. Can I like buy ammo or do I craft it or I didn't check upgrades. It's that Lexington thing. Yeah, I can't upgrade. Well, let me see if I can buy some ammo. Who do I spy? All right, let's sell some stuff. I'm just gonna sell everything I'm not using for the moment. I will keep that one in case I can figure out how to like upgrade it or something later. Let's get this pulverized thing and put it on that shotgun. And let's get a different scope for that SMG. I still don't know about ammo. A happy new gun owner, I hope. Oh, apparently I have two of them. Okay. Oh, I can't mod it. The tech shotgun. Interesting. Can't put a mod on that one. Or this one, apparently. I didn't see this before. You just scroll down under all. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it's right here. Well, I don't have a rifle now at the moment. I do need SMG ammo. Is that considered rifle? Oh, it's pretty cheap. I guess. I'm not sure how much ammo that actually just got me. Rifle. My shotgun. Is this rounds or... Boxes. That's what I'm curious about. Hold on. Let's try buying all that. See what that does. Maybe I just didn't... Oh. It is rifle ammo. Okay, so that's individual ammo. I got gotcha. you. Sweet. Well, now I have that. And I like this scope. That thing's all set up. Cool. Alright. Good to go. Alright, so some side jobs. There's also side gi or gigs, but I want to do some more side stuff. 13,000, 14,000, 17, 16, 21. I could buy one of these, but I don't really need to. Um, heroes. That's it. Caller. Oh, right. Jackie's, uh. B. Good to hear you. Finally. Been a long time since we talk. Since when Jackie passed away. How are you doing? How you think? My son is dead. But I am hanging in there. Calling to offer my condolences. Offer your condolences? Ay, eso Cristo vi. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Many of his friends will be there. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, B. All right, then. Let's head out there. So I had a stolen car last episode. It, uh, <laughs> it's still here. Still don't have my normal car. And it is still beat up, but whatever. We'll see if we can find another one sitting around out there. For now, let's head out this. I don't have like the strength requirement to just like take cars from people, like hijack them. But uh, you do see them sitting around. So, if I see one I like, 
and I can get it, I'll take it. Wow, that is one empty street. Sorry, man, I had nowhere else to park. Just gonna have to get over it. All right. The pool table, we got to get rid of it. Really? It's pretty massive. V, nice to see you. Oye, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. That's a big beer. Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Been better, to tell you the truth. What is happening? That night, when Jackie fell. Let's just say things haven't exactly been easy since. Yo sé cómo te sientes. Todos lo sabemos. I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. I want to take part in the ceremony, but... I want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket. That it do justice to his memory. I, mean, I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. I the veil. All right then. Pretty empty bar. I guess it is. Morning, 5:48 in the morning. But you'd think there'd still be some people. Well. Uh, my waypoint still hasn't updated. There we go. Oh, it's right here. I'm just gonna leave this car. I think it's about time we got something else. Um, why is it keep messing with my waypoint? Do I need to drive over there? Okay. Better change your line of work or you'll turn into a cynic. You're young. Move animals up in North Oak. Become a fucking priest or something. Just get off the street. How long you know they was watching Lily? Told her as soon as I found out. Not what I fucking asked. She wanted to do it alone. Didn't want to put you in danger. She knew it was out of our league. You ball as fucking coward. Hmm. All right, where am I going? Oh, look at that. Okay, got some gangsters. I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving. Ivy. Oh. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well, human. I guess. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. 
What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. Told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things. Disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. Well, it looks like he swapped out the exhaust pipe. What? I advised him to do it. Right before the job. All right. Locked. I wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere? Gotta be hanging here since 2020. 2020. Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say, barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? Found it. Anything else I'm looking at around here? All right, well. Oh, Jackie. Is that a mandala? Mm hmm. Oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. <laughs> Let's not be too rude here. It's beautiful. It's hideous. <laughs> That's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Um. Jackie's favorite tequila. Oh, still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him De Abajo had stolen her recipe. <laughs> Alright. Um We get onto his computer. Messages. Gorgeous Ryan looking for a new owner. Jackie, my man, you won't believe your luck. A collector is selling a beauty in prime condition. Price is good, a little, if a little over your budget. Let me know if you're interested, because if you aren't, it'll go to someone else. Peace, Sid. Saturday from Victor. Uh, this Saturday, this Saturday, the boys are competing for the World Heavyweight Championship. Civets versus Blanco. Beers are already cooling in the fridge. Don't forget about our deal. Blanco wins by KO in the third round. You better have the Eddie's. Not letting you off the hook this time. Dex from T-Bug. I vouched for you and V. He heard about you, remembered you all too well even. He'll want to meet with V. But I think it'll just be a formality. See you with the afterlife. 
Really, we're gonna do this? So wait a minute. Sequences I can select, huh? So the first one would be, wait, BD. I see how it goes now. BD, BD, B1C. Okay, never mind. Not sure why we did that, but taking this, yeah, perfect for Jackie. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. All right. Leather belt. Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why'd he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. <sighs> um... Should we take this? That kind of... I don't think we should take that. Talk to her. Stand here? No. Right. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What'd she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You gotta come, Misty. You got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So? Shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning? Packed my bags and hopped on a plane to Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. Still wish I had a wonk key. Because sometimes it doesn't do it for you. I mean, it feels really awkward randomly stopping and jogging around like this. They better not be having any problem with me telling her to come over here. My deepest condolences. He was a fine boy. Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. Hey, it's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, V. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, 
we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olo, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh, I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He bought some goods clipped from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. <laughs> A lizard. And, uh, I remember what he said then. That I came from a place where everyone's family must be too. Jackie Wells. Best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. kept Haywood in his heart, always. He made him who he was. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Heart on his sleeve, he didn't overthink things. He just went for it. He thought he was bulletproof. And, and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. And if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. He always wanted more than he got out of life. Rest easy, Chu. I would like to say a toast. Por mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offering that we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putica Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, B. Okay. Can we talk to anyone else in here? I guess we should talk to some people. Campos all torn up. I'm gonna miss him. Says he feels like he lost one of his own. I already do. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you die. <laughs> Me too, cabron. Me too. Not to Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Well, 
Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Who you another? Hey, For you! Yoquito. Have a drink with Listening's us. Listening's a skill, you know. To Wells? I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. Yeah. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. All right. Why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. Need you to focus now, okay? Poor. For Jackie. Amen, brother. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar. In his favorite spot, where he always used to sit. I'll have another. Have as many as you want. Talk to the Padre. Where's he at? Lupe's been handling the loss pretty good. She's a strong woman. You all right? Yeah. I think I'm just still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. Without your hermanos, you're nothing. Says the guy standing awkwardly looking at a wall. Okay. It's gotta be him, right? Just standing here on his own? Yeah. You uh, here to say goodbye to one of your own? Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. Jackie, do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. How are things in the streets? This is not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. It was just a question. But I bet you want to talk all about this, don't you? So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us? From up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. <laughs> I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Uh-huh. Okay, well, I guess we are done in here. Probably won't be scratching his motorcycle because I probably won't be driving it. Maybe one spin. But with how much I run into things, it's probably not a good idea. All of a sudden, there's tons of people out here. I have something I want to do that's not really a marked task, but I do want to go out of the city for a minute. Oh, my car is back. Never mind. I was gonna go find another car. Um, hold on. All right, that answers some questions, so I actually am not gonna do that. I went ahead and searched, and I was kind of right. You can store vehicles in the garage by your apartment, but they have to be, to store them permanently, they have to be ones you bought or acquired legally. Also, I'm gonna leave that motorcycle over there for now. What say we go do something else here? Fool on the hill. Wow. Find all the tarot graffiti in the city. 20. I don't understand this. Why is that mission not done? My car is repaired. I have it. I'm in it right now. That's weird. Maybe it's bugged out. Okay. Anyways.
Well, we got a lot of high danger things here. I guess we could go find another of Delamain's cars. Why not? Could use some money. Got a little bit of violence happening over here. Pardon me while I just destroy things. There's some gunfire. Neutralize the perps and secure the evidence. Perps. Holy hell. Damn, that's gotta hurt. It does. Is this way too difficult for me or something? EMP grenade at him for crying out loud. Oh wow. We got right. trouble. Well, these guys are tough. Damn it. Wow. Those guys were way too difficult for me. Okay. Well, I guess I shouldn't have gotten sidetracked by that. Either that or I just had really bad cover or something. Okay. I'm going to just ignore that. Also, while I'm thinking about it, I should probably equip something other than a um, EMP grenade. Frag grenades. Yes. Biohazard grenade. Applies poison. Recon grenade. Okay. There we go, frag grenade. Lots of damage. Let's grab that equipped for the moment. Alright, let's just do the mission. You are currently at the exact location where I lost contact with the car. Fine, I'll have a look around. Alright, you have a marker for it this time. Whoa. That's a cool view right there. Oh, there it is. What? Is it drunk? Beat me, motherfucker! Hey, <laughs> let's talk. I'm not going back! Hear me? Never! Try to take me and I'll crush you! Let's see who crushes who! Damage the car to deactivate it. Can I box him in and shoot him? He's gonna get away. Stop resisting. Stop resisting, car. If I get out, he's just gonna drive off. I would like to just get out and shotgun it, but he's gonna push right through me. Alright, let's just try it real quick. Is this even working? Oh, got it. That did the trick. Oh, whoops. <laughs> that was different. How fortunate. I've relinked to the vehicle. Thank you. Fortunate? I just killed it. <laughs> okay. That was that was different. Uh <laughs> Okay, there is something uh, non-mission related I would like to do. Let's go to a clothing store. There's one fairly close here. My character looks like a complete jackass at the moment. Got this weird coat on, he's got this weird helmet on. The car just sitting there. Uh, oh, we're at a gang place. I'm not really interested at the moment. Salt in progress. Should I take part in this? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh 
Okay, they're tough. And I'm getting jacked up. Why am I getting so jacked up so bad? Are these people just way too tough for me or something? He's got a skull. Does that mean he's too difficult? This is ridiculous. How am I supposed to kill these people? I'm trying to wait for my health. I'm just doing nothing. Wow. Let's just avoid him, shall we? I've got to get by here, though. Or can I go over here? Well, I came over here looking to replace my hat, bought something that was crap on accident, and just did nothing but lose money. What a surprise. I guess it's not really that important what I look like. Okay, well, that was a bust. Um, I'm going to go over to see what one of these things is here, see if maybe I can travel, fast travel, just to try it out. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so these are fast travel points. This is my mission. Let's see how this works. I mean, it's fast travel. It's kind of obvious, I guess, but... One of my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Uh -huh. Try to find it. Alright. It's moving. Get my car over here. What, is it going in circles or something? Get you back to safety. The garage. By driving through the streets. Well, uh, yeah, afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. Okay. You're welcome in, but do take it slow and try not to hit anything. Okay. Gotta drive it back and try not to hit anything. Great. So he was just up here doing circles. He's got anxiety. It's a cab AI with anxiety. Okay. I'll try to be careful. But you kind of picked the wrong guy for this. I run into literally everything. And traffic likes to run into you, too. Okay. I took it slow and managed to not run into a single thing. Finally. Oh, I shan't be alone here. See? It wasn't so bad. It was horrifying. But still, I thank you. Okay. <laughs> Sincerest thanks for your assistance, V. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee. D thanks. All right, well, I think I'm going to stop this episode here. I've been recording for a while. We didn't do a ton of side stuff, but we kind of did a main story component there, and I don't think we should dilute the episode too much more with random stuff. The uh, focal point was kind of the ceremony for uh, Jackie. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.